When shopping for the right iron horse riding gear, it starts with spandex. Yeah, you don't really want any bag. Well, you don't want any cotton against your skin. You want um, some kind of lycra. Depending on the weather. When in doubt, bring a jacket. I like to do shorts and then some knee warmers, mm -hmm. um, but if I know it's gonna be cold the whole ride, then I'll wear some knickers or some um, longer tights. What is good? Pockets. Pockets are your friend. A pocket with a little elastic. Um, that way food, phone, keys, um, other layers can go back there and then you don't have a lot of weight. If you wear gloves, make sure you've got these. Some little grippy stuff right here so you can grab the brake safely. <laughs> these are toe covers or shoe covers. Which give your feet extra protection from moisture and wind, but when you get to Silverton... What I like to do is I, I bring an extra set of clothes okay. in the sag wagon or in my parents' car. There you that go. way you can change and yeah. then you won't stink when you're around people. <laughs> Most importantly, layers. Layers. They're really important. Layers. Layers. <laughs> yeah, layers. On the road to the Iron Horse in the neighborhood, I'm Laura Schweizer, FourCornersTV.com.